everybody. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Maria. I'm Maria. And today I have another great Dollar Tree haul for you guys. Um, if you're not subscribed, I hope that you click on this video, like it, share it, and enjoy the content in it. Um, if you are a subscriber, thank you so much for returning. I'm really excited to have you guys and thank you for supporting me. Um, today I just have a huge haul and it's from a few different stores. I have some name brand things that I'm really excited about, some organization stuff that I'm really excited about. So um, let's just get into the haul. All right, so I'm gonna start off with boring stuff. I mean, it's basically been at the Dollar Tree for a long time. I pick it up when I need to replace it. And that is the All Purpose Cleaner Comet. And this is a big bottle of Comet. It's 24 fluid ounces. And it's all-purpose cleaner bleach and I love shopping at Dollar Tree for their cleaning products um, before I went to a dental office and started working there I used to clean houses and um, do clean outs for my husband's company um, when he uh, he's a painter so I would have to go into some of the homes and clean up after he was done painting or before um, and I love getting my products at Dollar Tree. Uh, the next um, thing in that category I picked up were these seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and I took one out already. <laughs> and they are scrub buddies. And um, they they get the job done most of the time. Um, I, my son likes the metal or copper that turn rust and everything he likes those and the brillo pads and stuff like that but um these there's seven of them they don't last long they start to crumble and fall apart like um the strings kind of come apart but seven of them for a dollar 25 is a great deal and i scooped it up so okay let's see what else i got um, in the cleaning kitchen section, I found this, um, splatter guard, splatter screen is what they call it. Um, usually they have the handles. This one, it has the top, the little round circle top. So I picked that up because it was different. I hadn't seen one of those at the Dollar Tree and I picked that up. I did pick it up for my daughter because I have one of these already. Um, let's see. Okay, we're gonna stay in the cleaning section. Um, I don't know if I showed these to you guys. These neat bleach tablets. Did I show these in my last video? Oh man, I don't know. I might have showed these already. Let me put this bag to the side just in case I did. I don't want to be showing things twice. Um, I also picked up the three pack of Kleenex. I need these in my purse when um, I go to church because when I go to church, I get convicted and I cry a lot. So um, I never have Kleenex on hand. I'm always looking for some. So I bought a three pack and I, they have like a six pack and an eight pack. But I went for the name brand, Kleenex brand, and I picked that up for my purse. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Um, I picked up these Essentials Kids Face and Body Wet Wipes. I was looking for something um, for the G-Babies because I did end up giving them the Sesame Street kits, uh, makeup kits that I uh, hauled for them in my recent video. And by the way, that video got a lot of views. I want to say, I don't know how many, but maybe like 3K, 3.9K views. Maybe, maybe more. It might be 6K. I'm not, I don't remember exactly, but um, I love that video. Uh, but I gave them the makeup. So I was looking for something to wipe their faces off with. So I did go ahead and pick these up for them. Um, I, since we are in Invisalign, our, my whole family is in Invisalign, 
Um, I picked up the hydrogen peroxide from there. It's $1.25, and that's what we soak our teeth in uh, when we're eating. All right. Um, what do I want to show you next? Oh, I found Surefresh Microwave Steam Bags. I have not seen these before. They might have been up, up there before, but I, I have never seen them and I've never used them, so I'm kind of um, interested as to what I can do with them. But it says six medium freezer to plate cooking bags, extremely lightweight and easy to use, use safely for microwave steaming. The, mic the uh, place the food and seasoning in the steam bag. That's number step one. Then close and seal the bags, the bags firmly, and then place the bag over the microwave, over the microwave with indicated side up and set the watts minute as required. And the bag will inflate during cooking and the microwave heated air can safely escape through the, to, through the valve. Wait at least 30 sec sections after cooking to handle the bags to open. Hold the top of the bag. Be careful as hot steam may escape. So, looks like you put fresh cut up vegetables in here. Whatever you'd like to heat up in the microwave. Um, in these bags versus just stick it in, in there in a bowl and cooking it. So, I thought that was a really good idea. But, I, you know, I might be a little slow to the game. But, hey, all right, what else do we have? Oh, so my son graduates on Thursday, and I went in the crafter section because he needs to decorate his uh, cap, and he wants to put a cross on it. So, I found, and I know this is something neat, but I'm not a crafter, so I don't know exactly how neat it is. But this is a four ounce glitter bottle and it's black glitter. And I am so happy that I found that. Um, it's AC, whatever that, oh, American Crafts. <laughs> AC, okay. I didn't know if that meant, but it's number one and that might just be the color black for them. And then I also picked up the craft crafters glue craft glue so um i figured that we would um make the hat the cross on the hat and the glue and then sprinkle the black glitter all over it pretty sure that that would look really nice so got that for him and then hmm i don't know maybe i did not show you guys that i had picked up these neat bleach tablets and there are um, 10 tablets per tube and then it's it's dissolves in, a, in hot or cold water and one tube is equivalent to a half a gallon of liquid bleach so it says to remove cap break and remove safety steel seal then push cap up with thumb and put in desired amount of water each, let me see. You could put it in the laundry. Um, begin filling the water with the washer with water, add one tablet to the water. That's for um, the machine. Two, I don't know. I don't want to read all that. It's a lot. <laughs> but um, what's the difference between, oh, original scent and linen scent? I was like, why are there two different colors? So original and linen. Okay. So pick you up some bleach tablets. If you really don't have room in your, say you live in a tiny home or an apartment and you don't have room for all these cleaning products, this would be great to keep in your underneath your sink. And then just use your bucket and fill up bleach water whenever you need it. Um, I also found these wizard, um, this one's Hawaiian scent. 
and it smells smells so good oh my gosh it smells so good that but this is an eight fluid ounce and this is wizard and it's a room mist and I picked that up and I had picked up another scent but I took it to work with me and then I also found these fabuloso complete disinfecting wipes and it's a 24 count and it's perfect to take with you camping um, in your car um, just on little road trips or whatever in your purse, um, have on hand when you're out and about. I love this idea. That's a great idea. Okay. Um, I got some food items. I picked up some more um, fun socks. Um, I picked up the Frank's Red Hot. I picked up the Hawaiian Punch. And I picked up the Rugrats. Rats. I got that. And then I also um, found some enamel guard extreme anti-cavity fluoride toothpaste for sensitive teeth. My teeth are sensitive and they've been a little bit more sensitive now that um, I've been wearing the Invisalign. So I picked that up for me. And this is a 2.7 ounce. So I got that. Um, I picked up some more of the, I went to my Dollar Tree and these two things that I had hauled um, in my prior video, the Twist brand, name brand, Twist brand, um, they're out of it at my store. So I was at another store and seen it there. So I picked some more up because for $1.25, you can't beat that. And my kid says he loves it. And I also at their store found this um, twist by Udad. 16 fluid ounce. This is conditioner. I did not find the shampoo, but I found the conditioner. And it's a big bottle. Um, so I was really excited to find that. <laughs> um, okay, I'm going to keep all the food together to show. So I'm going to show everything and then I'm going to get to the food. All right, what else did I find? Um, I picked up these party invitations for my son to fill out. I don't know. These might, I might have showed these already, but um, I picked those up. Then I found some silicone straw covers. So cute. I'm going to open these because I ha actually, I'm so thirsty. Today is Mother's Day. And it, I don't even know what time it is. I really, it's in the evening. Probably like six. I don't know. It might be later than that. I really don't know. But, um, Got up, went to church, went to Sunday school, went to church, um, came home and started getting ready for um, my kids to come over for Mother's Day. And I'm just now settling down. The house is pretty much cleaned up. The kitchen's wiped down. Um, but I was so thirsty that I had filled this up with water before I started filming. Um, these, it's a six piece silicone straw. Um, cover, which is so cool because my one daughter used to think that farts got in her cup. If anybody coughed, sneezed, um, uh, passed gas, anything near her cup that, um, it would get in and she would just cover it with her hand. Well, now she can cover it with a silicone straw cap and they're cute this is cute hold on daisy walker how cute is that that's so cute i'm so excited i am so excited about that that is so cute so that is a star and i think i'm gonna keep it on there and then we also got that looks like a Dolphin tail, whale tail, I'm sorry, a whale tail. 
That's a rainbow. You can see that. Um, this is a star, another star. Um, this is going to be a little cute face cloud. How stinking cute for their, for the straws. How cute. And then this is a daisy flower. That would, yes, a daisy flower. How cute is that? So cute. That is the cutest idea. I'm so excited. I, I, I think I'm going to go back and get a whole bunch more of these because I just think it's so cute. A straw cover to cover your, to cover your drink. Okay. Um, I found in the, um, uh, makeup aisle, uh, this nail grooming kit and it was so cute. I had to pick it up. I have plenty of nail grooming kits, but this was so adorable. The other one that they had in this actually, um, sassy and chic, um, it wasn't as cute, but this one was cute. The watermelon was cute. So this comes with an emery board, a cuticle trimmer, nail clippers, four, sh four fun shape nail files. Ha, ah, that's so cute. I love it. It's, it's adorable. So I picked that up. Um, I did find these cute, um, fabric gift bags and they're made out of burlap and they're so cute. It says teachers plant the seeds for tomorrow. And I think I'm going to give this to my, um, grandsons to give to their teachers, um, on the last day of school. So, or maybe I might fill it with something for Mac, my son that's graduating. I might fill it um, for maybe he could give it to two of his teachers that he really, um, really, really looks up to or, or loves or enjoys or whatever. I might fill it with something. I, I, I don't know yet what I'm going to do. But either way, it's going to go to a teacher because I, I think it's so adorable. Um, I did find these um, designer plates and there's 15 plates they're paper plates and they're really flimsy. It's nothing. This is just something to use at home for a hot quick second. And um, what's the size on these? Because I think they had a um, bigger one also. This is 8.75 inch by 8.75 inch. So, but there's 15 paper plates in here. So I just picked those up just to have them on hand. Um, okay, I found some puzzles. Um, my my G babies are getting bigger and older, and they're smart. And the toys that we had in the house were just a little bit too um, young for them. I feel, and I wanted to get some things that we could do together quietly. So I got a hundred piece puzzle. It's a puzzle uh, by Puzzle Bug. And this is a hundred piece and that's ice cream. And I picked that up. And then I also picked up one for my mom and it's a 500 piece. And um, I thought that was so neat. I, I really love these decorative bowls. Um, so I picked, I picked these up for me, for my mom. Um, and I might help her with it, but I picked one up for m me, just me. I don't know if the grant, if the G babies can do the uh, hundred piece and it looks like super easy to them, then I might let them help me with this one. But it's the cassette tapes, and I just this is like my um, childhood, um, sort of. I mean, that's what we listen to is cassette tapes. And I would sit on my bed and listen to the song and write down the lyrics. And you would have to rewind so that you could understand a word or the phrase or whatever. And I just, I love it. It reminds me so much of uh, just when I was younger. And when you start getting old, you start just thinking about back when you were younger and how much easier life felt back then when you were a kid, especially when you were a kid, didn't have to worry about adult things. 
Okay, so we're almost to the food. I got just a couple more things um, that I want to show, and then we're to the food. So, um, I ordered something for myself um, on Amazon uh, for Mother's Day, and um, it's like cubbies um, to put in my den. I think there's like 18 cubby holes in it, and I don't know how many of these I want to put in there. I might go back and get some more. But it's the um, Closet Essentials, and this is heavier weight, and it's a collapsible storage container. It is 10.5 inches by 11 inches um, by 10.5 inches high, and the pattern on this is the, um, it's kind of like a uh, foliage, and the color of it is kind of green. Babe, you want to come in and say hi? Um, so I picked that up. I picked up three of those. And you want to come in and say hi? No? Yes, no, maybe so. Um, everybody, this is my husband, Marvin. Oh, hey. yeah, he's got the headsets on. He's a gamer. <laughs> um, but I don't know. He probably has to pee or something. Anyway, yes, please get them <laughs> Uh, close the door. Okay, so I picked these up um, for the that cubicle. I picked up three, but I might need to get more. If there's 18 cubbies, um, I probably want to get a couple more of these, maybe like five to ten of them. Um, but anyway, I'm going to use them in that cubby hole for crayons and coloring books, um, different toys for the G-Babies. Um Maybe different things for myself and, you know, cubbies higher up so that the G-Babies can't get to it. Um, so, yes, these are beautiful. And I always look at these and I always think that they're, they all look okay. Not anything spectacular. Um, so, I never pick them up, but I love the way those look. So, I got those. Okay. Two more things and then we're on to the food. So, they had um, the two summer... Um, bees and lemons um, dishware. So this one is every day is a fresh start. And that is um, the way the pattern is for the summer lemons this year. And I think that's beautiful. And then this is the bee one. It's so cute. I don't know what the little one says or if it said anything. I don't remember. Um, but they have the glasses, the mugs. Um, all the towels and pot holders, everything in this line and this line in my store right now. And it's gorgeous. So I picked that up to show you guys, um, right now with having five men in my home, I want to go to paper plates. So I didn't, I didn't buy any dishes. I have dishes, but I'm about ready to throw all of them away and just use paper plates. Okay, we're going to get into the food, and then I'm going to be done. I'll stop boring you guys, but I just wanted to show you everything I got, um, whether I think it's something that uh, you would use or not. I, I, I just wanted to show you everything that I picked up. Um, I found some oven-ready lasagna by Columbia. It's another name brand product, um, and this is a 12-ounce for $1.25. Um, my daughter wanted to make lasagna the other day and we were trying to explain to her what kind of noodles to get. She just got her first apartment and I told her that I wanted her to get the oven ready lasagna noodles and she's like, what's that? And I had to kind of explain either you're going to sit there and parboil some noodles before you put it in the pan or you can just buy the ones that are oven ready. Well, at the Dollar Tree, they have the oven ready if anybody needs that. Um, I don't see these there all the time. Then I did pick up this California Healthy Harvest Roasted Diced Tomatoes, and this is a 28-ounce can. I picked that up. Um, the ingredients are okay. M mostly, they're good. Um, a couple questionable, questionable things. I like to just see tomatoes. <laughs> but at the Dollar Tree... Sometimes you can find something like that, but most of the time you can't. 
Um, then I also found this Asian stir fry seasoning mix. So I picked that up. My goodness. That lime writing is blinding me. So I did, I picked that up. All right. Okay, let me show the one thing that I picked up that um, I have a friend on YouTube that I just met, and her name on YouTube, she has her own channel. Her name is Adventures with Miss Peach, and she's adorable, and she does like a van life and tiny home. Um, she has a channel that focuses on those things, but she also does a lot of Dollar Tree hauls. And so that's how, I think that's how I came to know her channel was it was recommended to me. Um, she has been showing on her hauls that she picks up this hard candy for, I don't know if it's her students. I don't know if she's a teacher or a bus driver. I'm not sure, but she has students that she buys candy for. I want to say she's a teacher. I, I don't know for sure. Um, but she buys this candy to pass out to the kids. And this one is a 12 ounce. I grew up on butterscotch discs. My grandmother, um, had butterscotch discs all the time. Brock's, she had Brock's. And I'm telling you the difference between Brock's and this, there is a difference. They're so wonderful, the Brock's, but these are very good too. And so I picked these up. Um, they did have like the four to six ounce bag, but why would you buy that bag if you could get the 12 ounce for $1.25? So I picked that up and I, this is for me at work. Whenever I need like a little sweet thing in my mouth, I'm excited. So if you guys don't know Adventures with Miss Peach, please find her channel and subscribe to it. She would be happy to show you her van life and her uh, tiny home and her Dollar Tree hauls. So, hi, Miss Peach. Um, okay. I also found some more full-size bottles or jars of paste. This one is Chunky Salsa. This is a... I need my glasses again. That's that old part of me. Um, 16 ounce. Full-size paste. Salsa. I picked up two of these. I love full size name brand. Full size name brand. That's so exciting to me at the Dollar Tree. Um, there's another name brand. This is the Mr. Beast Cookies. And this is plant based, gluten free. And this one is the peanut butter chocolate chip. I picked these up. I tried the other ones, which you can see are on the back, the chocolate chip. I did not care for them. Uh, but you guys might love them. Um, but I picked up the other ones for my doctor because she is, she likes a lot of plant-based food. Um, and I don't know where it went. I don't think I gave it to her. So I'm going to take these to work tomorrow. Those are for her. She loves peanut butter and chocolate. She's a Reese's freak. So I'm going to take those to her tomorrow. Um, they are, um, right now they have the all peach sour patch kids. They also have the all grape. And then you know that they always have the watermelon. Watermelon ones are my favorite. These are probably my second favorite. I love me a peach. All right. And then I found there are three different, um, uh, ones of these and these are the feastables snack bars feast like a beast feast feastable snack bars feast like a beast it says on the back and this is five peanut butter chocolate um i don't know what it is though like i don't know if it's like a granola bar or what it is but it's a it says a snack bar it's a hundred and 90 calories, it's plant-based protein, seven grams of protein, um, peanut butter chocolate bar. And then the other, this one is the double chocolate. It's the purple box. And then they also had a red box. I'm trying to figure out, I wonder if it was milk chocolate. I'm not sure. 
I don't really know. That's it of the food. I did have one little thing that just got away from me that I did not um, see. It's so tiny, but it's these gel, um, active invisible gel heel little covers. I recently got a pair of slip-ons that gave me a little slice on the back of my heel. So I picked these up because I love the shoe and I want to wear it. Um, so until I break it in, I'll have to be using these little gel pads. That's it. That's my haul. Happy Mother's Day. I really hope that if you are a mother, that you enjoyed your day, that um, it wasn't um, sad in any way for you. Um, and if it was, I just, uh, I'll be praying that it wasn't. And I, I don't even know what to say. My mom lost her mom when she was 12. So I know that Mother's Day for everybody isn't, um, happy, but I just, um, if you are a mother, I just hope that you enjoyed your day fully. So thank you for being here and I'll catch you in the next one.